Hello, I'm Yuki from Hong Kong. I'm a third year computer science student and I'm from Penner College. Hi, my name is Jomika and I'm a second year computer science student here. I'm from India but I grew up in Dubai and I'm I'm in Lonsdale College. And we're here to give you a tour of what our labs yeah. look like. So let's go. And this is the only one without computers. As you can see there are really really study spaces and there are servers here for students to chat together and study together. And there is also a screen where you can like share the screen together when you're discussing group projects. And it's a great space for studying together inside the room. My group work, my group, we come here for my group project and we sit here and this is where we study together and then we go together here. And they've made this in like a round shape to encourage teamwork yeah. rather than everybody sitting separately. And it also gives like a nice view of outside as well, which is close right now. <laughs> But and it's great there are charging places for each of the desks so you can work together while like charging your phones or computers. So all the labs are access to our ID cards, or our student IDs. Uh, so only the cool kids who take computer <laughs> science can come in. There's a yellow wall over there. As you can see, it makes me feel really refreshed and awake while working on my coursework and there are also designed in groups of six so that students can work together as a group without feeling like being inside a working office and you can see that there are whiteboards over here so when we're kind of struggling on coursework or certain concepts we can write them out or draw it out so that it can make it easier to understand yeah, this is also where the teachers share their screen and so everybody can see them and this is where essentially you're going to be assigned your lab sessions and these are broken down into groups of 45-ish. For lectures, it is usually happening inside lecture theatres and while well, for lab we will be going into the science and technology building, so it's here. Yeah. Let's go to the other labs. Lab. This is the lab that I've been using when I was studying in second year for my computer science group project module. As you can see, there are screens over there. So when you're working together on a group project, you can share your screen with your group mates. So it's much easier to like, understand how each other's points are and like work on the project together. And here's the machine. This was actually um, a moon landing machine that a game was coded by first year students as their final coursework, which was installed in here and everybody was allowed to come in and play, which is a great demonstration of everything you get to do here. These labs are also accessed 24 seven. So right now is a Saturday morning, <laughs> but there are people that can just come in here yeah. and do what their work accessed by that card 24 seven. We have one more lab here, which is just similar. Yes. So and it's got more natural light over that side. This is my favorite lab because it's around the corner and usually people go to the other labs. So this is the lab that... Yeah. That, that's also where I have my so you are going to be sessioned in all of these different labs diff on different days again that's where the teachers share their screen and this is where everybody just comes together sits and studies and you are usually uh, as Miyuki you already yeah. mentioned you're divided into groups of six and this is essentially what one of the labs another looks like we have one over exit over there and this one here yeah, and for the lab machines, they are installed in Linux system, so you can store your things like in the H drive that is allocated to you, and you can also access the information that you stored on lab machines through an online website called My Lab, which will be given to students of Lancaster University, and you can access all the software or lab environments that have installed inside these systems. So you don't have to worry about if you prefer using your own machine or lab machine, and also, we can also use our own laptops and there are HDMI label cables 
that you can connect to the big screen so you can work on your own machine as well as the lab machines. Yeah, I think that's a great point you mentioned there because a lot of yeah. times I don't bring my laptop or if I'm working in the lab and I want to continue working at home, yeah. I can just log in using the my lab username and mm. password and continue working as if I was working in the lab. So yeah. that's actually like a really good it's advantage of this place, yeah. yeah.